Hello everyone. Welcome to week six uh, video lecture for Academic Listening Strategies 1. Uh, today we're going to uh, start with unit two, uh, listening B, unit two, listen B. That would be uh, the second lesson for unit two. Uh, so you should be ready uh, with page 34 of your textbook or page 34 of your online ebook. Uh, as usual, whenever you see this sign in the video, please stop the video and do the listening activity or do the exercise as asked in the textbook. Another thing you need to be ready is you need to have your my doc open. Okay, if your my doc is open, then you can uh, work on the listening activities from my doc so your assignment and listening activities all will available on my doc your course folder uh, let's begin first of all look at page 34 read and listen to what for to what four people say about their free time notice each word in blue and think about its meaning first of all please stop the video here and quickly read these four people's uh, what do they do in their free time? Then go to track 1.23 on my doc and listen to the uh, to what these four people say. So please stop the video here. Okay, I hope you have done a good job. You have finished reading and you have finished uh, listening to the uh, to whatever the four people say. Listen to 1.23 on my doc. So let's continue to the next exercise. Next exercise is vocabulary from page 34. You have these words given to you. What you have to do is match each word in blue from this exercise. Uh, from exercise A, you have these words, okay? Free time, benefits, enjoy, outdoors, healthy, common, crime, exercise, relax, disadvantage. Match these words to their definition. So again, please stop the video here. It's uh, like this and work on matching. When you finish, then come back and play the video again. I hope you have done that. So uh, if you got these answers, you have good answers. Free time is a period when you were not working. Benefits, that's it. Advantages or good results of doing something. For example, if you study hard, you'll be benefited. You'll get a lot of benefit, get a good score in exam, get a good job, and get settled in life. Enjoy, you all know that. Enjoy is to get pleasure or satisfaction from something. For example, me, I enjoy music. I enjoy reading books. You can say it in that way. Outdoors is the open air outside, outside the building and healthy is strong and well it's not sick so are you a healthy person uh, it's always good to be healthy and it's always very important to be healthy common is usual which happens quite often um, for example these days it's uh, a rainy season so a rainfall is quite common in japan crime is an action that is against the law which is prohibited by the law, which is really bad. Exercise is physical activity that keeps you fit. For example, you go out to the park and exercise, okay? Relax is to get pleasure or satisfaction from something. For example, when I want to relax, maybe I listen to the music or I lie on my coach or something. Uh, disadvantage. Okay, there's a mistake. Let's fix that. This advantage B is missing there. Okay, uh, how do I write there? ADV. Disadvantage. Disadvantage is negative point, something that can create a problem. Okay, so you have to submit this through Google Form as your homework. Keep that in mind. Okay, let's go to the next activity. Next activity again. You have to use the words given uh, in exercise B to fill in the blanks there. So stop the video here and take about three or four minutes time 
and fill in the blanks with the correct verb. When you finish, come back and see the answers, okay? So I hope you have done that. Let's see. So answers would be there. Number one, I'm not going to read everything for you. Please read that by yourself. Number one, free time. Number two, enjoy. Three, disadvantage. Number four, benefits. Number five, relax. Number six, exercise. Number seven, outdoors. Number eight, healthy. Number five, nine, crime. And number 10 is common. So I hope that uh, was a really good practice for you to study the vocabulary. Now, open your textbook to page 36 uh, before listening, okay? You're going to listen to a guest speaker talk about city parks. What do you think the speaker will say about the importance of parks? So this is just uh, your opinion. What do you think? Why parks are important? For example, parks give you uh, open space where you can go and exercise. Maybe children can, can go there and enjoy, play. There are so many uh, good points so, uh, of the city parks. Or, or any kind of parks. So think about your answers. Uh, sorry. And uh, two questions there on your textbook. Uh, that was uh, from page 35, right? Why do people enjoy parks? So why do they go to enjoy parks? There are so many reasons, but for example, it gives them a green space in which to spend their free time. So for example, everybody loves to spend their time when there is a green space. Next, it is a good place to exercise outdoors. So those are some reasons uh, people enjoy parks. But people say that governments are spending a lot of money to make parks, okay? So what are some disadvantages of spending money on parks? So you can think about your answers, but some examples are, for example, when a uh, government or cities spend so much money on parks, then the money cannot be spent on other things, such as education or infrastructures, making, uh, making uh, buildings, ro railroads or roads. So there are other important things. So they cannot be spent, the money cannot be spent there. And maybe the second one, it takes up space that businesses could use because when, once there is a park, you cannot use that for other purposes. Instead, you can use that space to uh, create another business. So that could be some reasons, okay? So these are some ideas that you got what the listening will be about. Now, before we go to the, do the listening, look at note-taking scale. Note-taking scale is, uh, please, Stop the video here for a couple of minutes and read the note-taking skill passes there. And when you finish reading, uh, most important thing uh, when you take notes is make two columns and write details in one column and the kind of heading or the idea the details will support in another column. That way it will be easy for you to come back to your notes later. For example, Parks, good for exercise. And for example, what kind of exercise? Walking. So if you have this information and if there is a question, for example, what kind of exercise is most important? Then you can easily find your note and it's easy to see the answers in your notes, okay? Now we are almost uh, in, uh, towards the end of the video uh, while listening. So now please go to uh, my doc and pathways track the list and choose track 1.24 then read the following statements uh, when you finish reading listen to the speaker talk again from my talk and complete the missing information this is from page, page 36 so listen to the audio and work on this you'll have to submit this through a uh, google form assignment again okay and next is on page 37, read the statement and answer choices. Then listen again and choose the correct answer. Again, listen to the uh, talk on track 1.24, then complete your answers there. 
when you finish uh, answers, you'll have to submit your assignment through Google Form. Your assignment will uh, be sent through my doc, and your assignment will be based on pages 34, 30, 34, 35, 36, and 37 of your textbook. I hope you're having a good time, and uh, please submit your assignment and stay safe. And that's all for the, for the class today. We'll see you again. We'll see each other again next week. Goodbye.